Hi, this is Mrs. A, camp director from Allen's Lane Art Center, coming to you with another art challenge. This challenge is the, the music. Now, what I mean by that is you have to make your instrument, you can be your instrument, and you have to play your instrument. So, making your instrument. A couple of samples. This is just plain water that I put food coloring in. Regular food coloring. There's a lot of things you can use to change to a different color. If you notice, I have different heights of the water because it makes different sounds. So, that's one of the things. Another instrument that you can make from household goods and cooking utensils is a drum. So, and wooden sticks. So you can get your... Last but not least of our making our instruments is now this one is real simple. You get some measuring spoons, you put them in a really great little package here, and I'm also taking a pie cutter, a crust cutter, pastry cutter, and I've got my other sound. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to have Miss Tracy, our assistant camp director, show you how to make a rain tree. See you soon. A paper towel, um, cardboard, or you can use a aluminum foil or saran wrap cardboard. That's actually a little better because it's a little sturdier. You can also use a Pringles can or you can use wrapping paper cardboard which is really nice because it's longer so your rain sound you, you'll be able to hear it better. You want to use rice or black eyed peas. You only want to use um, a little bit. I'm going to show you one that I completed. Okay. And on mine, I use the Chinese symbols for honor. So I use the magic marker to do this. And I used house paint for the red. And as you can see, I use the masking tape to just secure it and give it a nice finished edge. As you can see on the back, I use the thumbtacks. Okay, and this is what it should sound like. You can move it slowly. Or you can use it fast.